Hi guys, my name is Arun Kumar Bedi from usitrecruit.com. Welcome to CPAL Unlocked Lesson 6, where CPAL Unlocked is a series of videos about CPAL ATS on how a recruiter can use CPAL to the fullest. If you are watching our videos for the first time, please do subscribe and hit on the bell icon to get notified whenever I release the video on this channel. So today we are going to see how, how to source resumes from portals in CPAL. So let's get started. Let's see how to source uh, resumes from CPAL through portals. So in order to source the resumes through CPAL from portals, just click on this quick links or the floor grid icon at the top right corner and select advanced search and select all any uh, job portal which is which has been uh, mentioned here or which as your company has been integrated with cpal so let's take if you are, if you want to work on dice just click on dice and this is what the interface when you log into dice through cpal and just it is asking to give the keywords here just type just type the keywords which you are searching for and if you want to search if you want to search for any particular location you can also give the location here or else you can also just click on search candidates so you will be getting uh, candidates from the search which you have given here and if you want to uh, open our resume you just need to click on the name of the candidate that will open up the resume from the right of the page so you can either download this resume from here or else if you want to or else if you want to uh, write in notes here right now just click on this button and write the notes right away here and if you want to email just click on this button this will open up a new tab wherein you which you need to give the subject line and the template which you're gonna following from your company's end click on end so that you can able to send the email from the cpal to this respective candidates and if you want to call you have the phone number here and this is what the email address of the candidate so we have multiple filters to the left of this page in dice so you can use multiple filters to uh, in to reduce the number of candidates and to get a qualified candidates from here so we have another feature which is in dice which is called intelli search so what does this intelli search will do is just in, in order not to give so copy paste the job description which you want to work on and give the title of the job so as i am working on salesforce developer And if you want to give the state or city which you're going to work, just give it here or else just click on search candidates. And as you can see here, we will also get the candidates when you go with IntelliSearch. So what is the difference between normal candidate search and IntelliSearch is if you don't want to give any kind of strings or any Boolean search here, you can go with IntelliSearch which works on AI. And this is the normal candidate search where it will work on the manual strings which you give. So this is how we can able to search from dice and let's go to monster. So this is what the interface you will be getting and where you will need to give the keywords here to search on and we also can use multiple filters which is here. And if you are a power search lover, you can just switch on to the power search in the monster as well. So we have uh, different types of search can be done, which is a semantic search. You can go with the job title or you can uh, go with the skill set and the keywords. And if you are working with a Boolean search or a Boolean expert, just select this Boolean search and give the Boolean operators here. And you can play around with all the filters in here and just click on search. And there's an important filter here if you're specially searching for US citizens and green cards here. Just check these two boxes and click on search. So this is how we can able to search from monster. And if you want to search from career builder, let's switch to career builder right now. So this is what the interface you'll be getting from the career builder. So paste the same uh, whatever the job you are working on. Just paste the boolean search here and if you want to search for only specific locations just give the location here and click on search. So this is how we can able to source the resumes from portals through cpal. 
I hope you have liked this video. If you have liked this video, please hit on that big fat like button below and share this video if you want to. And please write down something in this comment section which is useful in this video or if you want to ask something. And at last, before we wrap up, please do visit usitrecruit.com for more recruitment articles, tools and tips. And do subscribe to our channel for more updates. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Arun Kumar.